the hindrance, that's for sure. Well, this Thanksgiving, the Gallatin County Food Bank will help put food on the tables of more than 600 families. Even with a generous year, the organization could use more food to help meet the need in Gallatin County. Our Cassie Sherm was at the Thanksgiving meal pass out today and talked with organizers and residents on how much these donations will help that community. Volunteers are using the last couple days before the holiday to load up cars and hand out Thanksgiving dinners. I talked to some of those who received these dinners and they say they couldn't be more thankful. Well, it's food. We don't go. We don't get to go hungry, which is a very good thing. When I have the capabilities, I do the same thing myself. Why? Because people did for me when I when I couldn't. Bob Bushel and his wife were left in a situation last year where the little help goes a long way. Earlier this year, my wife and I, we were forced into homelessness by, uh, well, misunderstanding to say the best. Um, so this is our first year here in Gallatin County for the food bank, and they've been extremely helpful. Bushel says this meal means more than most people know. Without this, a lot of people are going to be on the streets hungry, very hungry, if not frozen. The meal includes items like potatoes, cans of green beans, butter, and of course, turkeys. Food bank employees say this year the community has really stepped up to the plate. Just in the season of giving around Thanksgiving, people are more than generous. So it, it's been beautiful to be able to fill up the whole food bank. Thanks to the Can the Grizz competition, they have about 2,800 frozen birds now. They also received more than 200,000 pounds of other food items. It lasts well into the spring and into some of our drier donation times of the year, so we're grateful to be able to stretch it out over the long haul. So we'll have people who are really appreciative and thank our volunteers who are working today as well, um, just because they need that extra little bit of help. Bushel would like to thank those who gave his family this Thanksgiving meal. A lot of folks out there, people, that need your help. Not just myself. To all of you out there that donated, be it with food or, or funds, thank you. And God bless you for doing so. Tomorrow is the last day to get a Thanksgiving dinner or if you have any donations for this Thanksgiving meal. Reporting here in Bozeman, I'm Cassie Sherm. Now something else to be thankful for, the amount of volunteers that helped out with this cause. Over 200 people helping deliver those Thanksgiving meals. Yeah, it never ceases to amaze me the number of people that turn out to help and the amount of money that people give. People are just so generous here in Montana. Yep, just an hour of your time can make all of the difference. Time for weather and I tell you what, we've got a little bit of winter weather